Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Taurians. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading for the month of February. I hope all is well, my loves. I hope you're taking care of yourself, Taurus, okay? I hope you are taking in plenty of vegetables and fruits, as always, and definitely drinking plenty of water, Taurus, okay? So today we're going to start with your higher self, your angels, and your ancestors. We're going to see what messages Spirit has for you, referencing to your, lo your soul life journey, okay? With the soul lesson journey oracle deck here, excuse me. And then we're going to move forward, Taurus, and see what's going on in your love life, okay? We're going to see how this person is feeling towards you, how you two are in the connection doing here, all right? And what further details we can get. We're definitely going to pull cards from the Love Romance Angel deck here. So definitely stick around, Taurus, to see what further messages come out for you, okay? Now, the readings here today, Taurus, may resonate for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and South Node placements. And again, Cross Watchers, welcome back, my loves. You are welcome here as well. I hope all is well, Taurus, okay? So let's see. <clears throat> Excuse me. Give me one moment. I'm gathering myself here. All right? So let's see here, Taurus, what messages your higher self, your angels, and your ancestors have for you so that way you can shift the energies here and get into your love life, okay? So let's see here. Skill with what do we have for Taurus? Some moon rising Venus, North, and South node placements. Definitely, my loves, don't forget to click on that notification bell so that way you can know when I post your readings as well. Before we get started here, so that way you are aware, Taurus, I do post your readings every three days for the ones that are new here, all right? And definitely select all on that notification bell, so that way for any other updates, notifications, or when I go live as well, you will be notified, Taurus, when I go live. I also answer love questions that you may have, okay? If you have any questions in regards to love, all right, they're only $5.55 only doing my live stream videos, okay? Also, if you would like a full spread like we're going to do here today, Taurus, it's only $15.55, all right? And if you would like a more private reading, you can email me and that information is down below in the description box and we can do a full spread there as well for only $25 for your private email reading, Okay, and it also goes into full details through the email, I say. All right, so let's move forward here. Let's start with your higher self. And then again, Taurus, the bulls, we're going to shift the energies and see what the love life is looking like here for the month of February. I say, I say, all right, source angels, ancestors, protect my space and aura here as I channel the messages for Taurus, where their higher self want to inform them during this time for the next three days. For the God and Goddesses, for the Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine, what do their higher self need to know, Spirit, during this time? For my Tarzans, what do they need to know for the Earth Element, Spirit? What do their higher self need to inform them during this time, Spirit? Ooh, freedom, freedom. Yes, my loves, freedom. All right, so you all are in the energy of feeling free right now. Some of y'all may have started over with the cycle here. All right, some of you all are just happy that you're free right now. And some of you all are experiencing the energy of freedom, okay? This talks about, again, I possess the power and the free will towards to create my own happiness. Wow, beautiful, I am loving that, Taurus. Oh, my goodness, okay? So, again, I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness, okay? Oh, my goodness. So, know that whatever you want to create in the next three days here or in the new cycle, the new year, or the new month here for February, all right, whatever goals that you have in mind, your angels and your ancestors, Taurus, is wanting you to know that you have 
all the ability. You have the capability. Spirit is saying here, thank you to manifest whatever you want, Taurus. Okay, don't allow any type of thought or negative thought or feeling to tell you otherwise. Okay, you are very smart. You are very intelligent, Taurus. Okay, you know your worth. Okay, you are the sign that represents and knows your worth. Okay. Part of your sign as well is the Venus planet as well. You know, and people can understand and know their worth. And you naturally can teach them that by things that are more materialistic of this world, okay? So because of that power and gift that you have within you, okay? Know that as well that it is within you. And you deserve freedom. You deserve love. And all that you are desiring and having passion towards as well. So, wow, beautiful. Thank you, angels. Those are messages, again, from your angels. They want you to spread your rings, Taurus. They want you to set yourself free. You are now free. And for some of you all, you're about to be free, okay? This could be meaning in regards to a cycle here. Again, I stated that's ending for you. And now you're going into a new cycle, a new beginning, all right? And everything is fresh. Everything is going to be new for you. Again, this is an energy where I feel like for whatever reason, you're set free, all right, Spirit is saying here, so I'm ready to get into this reading here and see what this is all about. All right, that's a lot of freedom energy there, okay? Some of y'all may be literally coming up out of a relationship, coming up out of some type of situation that I feel like you may were around for quite some time or you may have dealt with. It could be, again, a relationship here or this could be referencing to your career, what it is that you want to do. Whatever this is, you now have the freedom to be able to move forward towards all right, you have the freedom to be able to make the decision and however you put your mind to it because you deserve your happiness as well. And that way, when you're free, you're able to create, right, whatever you wanted to create as well because you're now in this space to think, I feel. I feel like some of y'all wasn't in a place to think at one point in time or just, you know, take time out for yourself. Well, So whatever type of freedom I'm feeling here energetically that you're going to be processing here which is great okay i feel like you guys need it okay and definitely get you some rest and make sure you're getting enough hours of sleep okay sleep is healing healing is sleeping i say all right yes because spirit your angels is wanting you to stay very optimistic when it comes to your love life all right Taurus, stay very optimistic here do not give up all right know that positive thinking and faith will bring you romance Taurus. okay so some of y'all now that you are free so again, like I said, some of y'all may have ended a relationship here. What's the bottom of the deck? Yes, romantic feelings, okay? So you're meeting someone new for some of you all as well that's on that timeline, okay? There is romantic feelings between you two. It says your feelings are real and worth exploring. Wow, beautiful energy here. So far, we have stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance and romantic feelings is at the bottom of the deck. What's at the bottom of the deck is what we never see coming towards, okay? So there is someone around you that have very much strong feelings in regards to you or you two, vice versa. Feelings towards each other is very strong here, Taurus. Wow, beautiful. Okay, so stay optimistic as well for the ones that are single. When it comes to your love life, your angels is wanting you to know that you're free. So express yourself, express yourself in how you would in a loving way, all right? In a way that you know, I'm hearing that you know your worth, okay? So some of y'all are not understanding or knowing your worth, okay? Or knowing what you are worthy of, all right? <clears throat> Excuse me. My apologies. I've been, I've been outside in the snow, honey. So, oh my goodness. My apologies if I seem to take short breath. I've been outside screaming and yelling around, playing like a big-ass kid out in the snow with my family. So, excuse me. Okay. Now, moving forward. So, again, there's a lot of romantic feelings here, Taurus, in regards to you and this person here, okay? So, let's see here. Let's see how their feelings now are towards you, Taurus. Let's see how they feel in regards to this romantic connection that you two have here. All right, let's see what energies are still surrounding you, Taurus, during this time here. Again, for the next three days, definitely click the notification bell. All right, so again, that your way you're notified the next three business days. All right, the next three business days. 
Some of y'all are waiting for something and it may take up to the next three business days. That literally just randomly chatted out there for, okay? So some of y'all, that may be significant for you, all right? Within the next three business days, you may be ready to hear some news within the next three business days. So that might be significant for you. I was going to say, again, click the notification bell so that way you can be notified within the next three days when your reading is posted. So we can see where the energies here or these romantic feelings have progressed to, okay? Let's see. How do they feel, Taurus? How do they feel towards my bulls? How does this person feel towards Tarzan? What are their feelings here? How do they feel towards... Ooh, thank you. Oh, we have... I regret lying to you, Taurus, okay? We also have, I knew exactly what I was doing. Wow, okay, so this person is doing a lot of confessing here as well. All right, this is something that I feel like they may wasn't doing here once before in the past or they wasn't expressing themselves. Or again, <clears throat> excuse me, let me drink some of my tea. Give me one second. Or again, excuse me, it says, I knew exactly what I was doing. I regret lying to you, Taurus, okay? And also, I know I was a distraction from your pain. Wow. So this person also feels like that maybe you, you know, you two got together because you two may were in a process of, you know, still having energies that you were working through. Feelings, thought, emotions that you were working through or you both were working through right here. And this was a situation where you felt like or this person, however, Taurus felt like they were only a distraction for your pain. You were just someone to, you know, communicate with, have fun with, hang out with, exchange energies with. All in all, this person was hurt <clears throat> or excuse me, vice versa, Taurus, you were hurt. And this person felt like they were just a distraction from your pain, from whoever you previously were either with, had an experience with in regards to a relationship, all right? And they are now understanding that they feel like during that time when you two were exchanging energies together here, towards that they were only a distraction, a distraction, excuse me, thank you, spirit, for the connection here between you <clears throat> and your person. Wow, this, this reading is a little deep. Taurus, okay? I feel you leaving me behind. Wow, yeah. So I feel like this is a person that you haven't communicated with in quite some time now. Again, this is someone from your past. It could have been a couple of months here where you two were not in communication with each other. I'm getting here as well. Wow, and at the bottom of the deck, we have I'm so attracted to you. All in all, even though no matter how long or how Far apart, I feel like you two are separated from each other. This person still thinks about you, I feel, on a regular. I'm hearing here. Wow, so they still think about you on a regular. They still think about you on a daily basis. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Before we pull out the tarot deck, now let me finish up here. Let's pull a couple raw feelings out here in regards to the deck I created here with the raw tarot deck. We're going to see how they truly are feeling towards you with the raw tarot deck. It kind of goes over feelings and emotions and thoughts that they may not tell you face to face. Only keeps to themselves type of raw feelings. Okay. So let's see what we can get out of this stack here for you. And then we will finish up here again with the tarot deck for you. Okay. Definitely, my loves, that the reading here is resonating with your spirit and your higher self. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Again, hit that notification bell so that way you're aware when I go live. Also, my loves, if any information you'd like to know about the channel here is down below in the description box, Taurus. I love you so much. And thank you guys for always sharing your love and support. Thank you so much. I love you. Let's see here. Let's see how this person is feeling towards you, Taurus. Ooh. Oh, I want to stay forever. Oh my goodness, Taurus. This is the energy that I was feeling as well. It's kind of like a bittersweet here, okay? This is a situation where this person had a lot of feelings for you. I feel like you as well, Taurus, had a lot of feelings for this person as well. And this could have been a situation. You know how they say wrong place, wrong time. 
type of situation, right, Taurus? This is what I feel like this is the energy with this person that you two maybe wasn't able to see eye to eye at the time. Because you both had other things going on that you may were dealing with or you may too was closing out cycles. And it was a distraction again here. Wow, thank you, Source. All right, beautiful. Let's finish up here. I'm going to now pull out the Modern Witches Tarot deck. Wow, we already have some jumpers there for you. Yes, Taurus. And let's see what Tarot has to say in regards to this connection here. All right, so the first card, wow, the first card we have come out was the Seven of Swords. All right, so this was a person at one point of time here who may have done something behind your back, Taurus. They may have lied to you. They may wasn't honest to you with the Seven of Swords. Here we know the Seven of Swords represents energies that may have, you know, lied to you, stabbed you in your back, did things behind your back, said things to others behind your back, lied to you behind your back, done things that wasn't of their highest good behind your back, or didn't make good decisions in regards to this relationship, this connection, okay? And some of you all towards this person could be an Aquarius or a Libra or a Gemini here with the air energy, okay? Now, however, this card wanted to come up in reverse. Now, in reverse, we know that this is a situation here that this person is not necessarily trying to strategize, strategize this situation. Well, I don't even say that word, okay? But however, this is a situation here. We know the card is in reverse, that this person is not coming from that space, right? They're not coming from that space or at least anymore. Thank you, Spirit. Wow, thank you for, com for that confirmation for some of you all. So again, this person may came to you once before. Is of course why you two are separated now, Taurus, right? And now they are coming towards you in this energy, right? They don't want to be the energy looked at as being lied to all the time or not being honest to you, right? I feel like they're coming to you as well for an apology here as well because they, re re they regret, excuse me, lying to you, right? They regret it, Taurus. I feel like this is beating this person up. Okay, and they're wanting to communicate with you. They're wanting to talk to you. I'm hearing they're wanting to apologize to you as well. Wow, beautiful. So let's finish up here. Let's see what other cards come out in regards to this connection towards beautiful, beautiful reading. Yes, definitely, my loves. Hit that like button. Let's get this video out to your fellow Taurians, okay, so they can be aware of this person that's coming back towards them because this is definitely someone that you all are very familiar with. Okay, so if it's definitely resonating again, definitely let me know. Comment down below, okay? I would love to know to see what has transpired here between you two. Because this is a connection that, you know, you two had a very much deep connection here. I love it. All right, so finishing up your reading, we have the Four of Pentacles. Here you are. This is your energy, Taurus, okay? <clears throat> so again, this is a person here that you held your energy back for. From, excuse me, for a long time, Taurus. You held your energy back from a long time from this person, okay? When we come out with the four swords, that's holding your energy back. Held your money with the pinnacles here, right? Material things, all right? And just any time given to this person or any of your energy at all given to this person, I feel like you held back from this person, of course, because they lied to you one point in time, right? Or vice versa, Taurus. This is you. All right, we all grown over here. We know our size shoe. So if it's resonating for you or your person, then that's great. Absolutely. Again, let me know down below. However, if it's not, it's okay. Just sit back, enjoy the ride. Click the notification bell for the next three days and we'll see what comes out for you. All right. So let's see here. Wow. Yes, we got the tower moment. Some of y'all, this person may be a Scorpio. Or they could be a fellow earth sign like you. This is Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo energy here as well. Or again, we have Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra here. Now Scorpio coming out. And wow, then we have Libra energy again coming out here. This person can have Libra placements in their chart. All right, but we know justice is here. So definitely when the card justice comes out for me, just let me know that this was a situation here that was not injustice, okay? It was not fair. It wasn't give and even take here. Okay, someone was breadcrumbing someone. Someone was not giving the time and effort as the other was. Okay, I feel like someone was not meeting 
in the middle here, Taurus, okay? Rather, this is your person or you here. But now, this person is wanting to give you that justice. And I feel like for some of you all, this will be the justice because this card again came out in the reverse. So no longer I feel like is this person in the mindset to hurt you or at least to intentionally do it. Because you see how she's looking over her shoulder here as if she know what she's doing, right, Taurus? But when it's coming out in reverse like this, this person don't have those intentions anymore to or even have those desires to come at you like that. And this is why the Major Arcana card come out here for justice because angels, the universe is confirming this as well that this is how you, for some of you all, will particularly receive your justice by this person coming back, admitting to what they've done wrong and actually fixing it because there are people that actually do that and will actually fix it. Now, unfortunately, we have others that won't. They'll wear the mask, pretend to for a couple of days, about a week or so, and they'll be back right into their own energy, okay? Because you'll be able to know if this person is genuine or not, right? You'll be able to know, Taurus, okay? And I feel like for some of you all, because again, the connection here between you two is very deep. It's no denying it, all right? That's why this person is now regret lying to you, right? What's the last card here? Wow, yes. We have the Two of Swords, and this card came out in reverse. So again, this person is no longer indecisive, all right? Or again, Taurus, if this is you, you're no longer indecisive in regards to this connection, in regards to this person, in regards to this relationship. Or again, Taurians, my bulls, this person is no longer in their head with the swords here, right? Doing things behind scenes. Both of these cards came out in reverse. So not only are they ready to confess and tell the truth, but they're no longer wanting to hide their feelings, their thoughts, their emotions, okay? And they now know what it is that they want. Wow, Taurus, fuck some shit up here. Oh my goodness, wow, I am definitely speechless in regard to your reading here. It definitely explains the romantic feelings. You need to continue to stay optimistic about your love life and definitely, all right, enjoy your freedom, all right? Wow, this has completed your reading here, Taurus. Again, I hope the reading has resonated with who we needed to resonate with. Definitely, if so, don't forget to like, subscribe. Again, hit the notification bell. Join me when I go live, my love. Click on that last previous video there just to see how things work. Again, if you would like to ask any love questions, it's only $5.55. And a full spread here like this here, so it's only $15.55. And again, if you would like to personal schedule a email reading for privately, that gives you full details here and also a full spread. It's only $25, okay? All that information is down below in the description box, my loves. Again, take care of your health because your health is your wealth, Taurus. I love you. Bye-bye.